Hello trombone players. So we are working on Spooky Mansion today. Please make sure you have your instrument. Please make sure you have your music and follow along and play along with this video so you can learn your notes. All right, so we're starting at the very beginning of Spooky Mansion. We start on the note C, sixth position. Then we go to D4, E flat, three, F1, G, four again. So those notes sound like this. <laughs> Okay, so and then we want to play them as staccato notes. Like little stepping stones going higher. So work on doing those long sounds, get those pitches to come out. Um, so. You need to take your mouthpiece. Okay, and if it comes out that sounding like that, then that's excellent. If it comes out sounding like, it sounds like air coming out, we're not getting a buzz. And if it sounds like this, it sounds like the air is not getting out. So you need to have a happy medium where the air is going through your lips, but it's not just passing through like, and it's not so closed that we're, it's really hard to get air out, but kind of right in between. And you can kind of lips moving back and forth. Okay. So again, they sound like this. Play his quarter notes, nice and short. the better it sounds every time so that means that my lips are working and memorizing where they're supposed to be and measure three we go from c e flat c e f oh sorry c e flat third position c e flat and then fourth for g so now that's going to be tricky because g is going to be higher than e flat also in fourth position, D, and D is lower. So if it goes lower, you can hear it's not right. That's not what we want. Get up higher. Now the next one, we do want it to go lower. Same slide positions, just one is going up to G and one goes going down to D. And then seven goes back up to G. So let's go three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Starts on C. Ready? All right, so it's the same pattern. It's six, three, six, three, four, but some of them go higher, some of them go lower. Measure nine, we start on G. That's where we just left off. G, F, E flat, D. Sorry, don't forget that. C. Now that's that's straight out of our concert B flat scale, um, except we're starting on the sixth note and we're only going down to the second note. So it's the same note, same pattern. Just starting and ending on weird notes. All right, measure 11, we go back up to G, E flat, D, E flat. So just going four, three, four, three. And then again, G, E flat, but this time we go to F in measure 14. And we gotta find that because F is higher than E flat. All right, 15, we have the same thing as 11. And then 17, we have G, D, C. So G and D both in fourth position, C down to six. Okay, so let's do uh, measure 11 up to 19. Got some water. 
Get rid of that. Okay, so here we are on G, fourth position. One, two, three, four. it doesn't go to E flat it goes to D so staying in fourth position there all right now at 19 again starting on the note G a lot of these phrases start on G so it could be a, kind of like our our ground point where we always know where to go back to so we have G D G all in fourth position <laughs> So G, D, G, F, E flat, D, C. That's exactly what we played in 9 and 10. So same exact pattern. Okay, we ended on C in measure 21. We go back up to G. Wonderful. 22, back down to C, so C to G. practice that's fun in 22 we have c d e flat c jumps back up to g and then d that g to d pattern again and in 24 we have g d e flat d so this part's pretty tricky it does have a lot of jumping around not a lot of the same notes it doesn't have a lot of pattern to it so here's 19 up to 25 one two Okay, so again, it's a lot of jumping around. Definitely want to practice those big intervals like the G to the D and the G to the C. Those are definitely ones you want to practice. So I would say go back, rewind, and do 19 again. Um, in measure 27, we just have G, F, G. And that's pretty bad. So here we go. That's not G. And those are short because they have staccato and then we get to scream. At 29, same two notes. G, F, G. Fermata over that G. So we sustain long note. We have in measure 30, go to F, E flat, D, C. Now be natural. Is, so if this is six, B natural is going to be in fifth position. It's not fourth, it's not sixth, it's five. It's a new note, and then we go to C again. But note that at 29, 30, where you go G, F, E flat, D, C, those are, that's, you've played that. You've played that at least three times already in this song. So here is 29, where we sustain out some notes. Ready? <laughs> Be natural and the trombone. I'm like 90% sure it's in fifth. This is in the way. Mm. What does it say? Be natural. What the heck? This is very small. It's um B natural. Oh, it says seven. I can't reach seven. Can you guys reach seven? Yep, it says seventh position. Okay, so I lied. It's not five, it's seven. So five would be here, six is here, seven is like almost all the way out. Hmm, my arm doesn't that long. Uh, uh, uh. 
pretty low it's pretty low in there okay so we gotta go all the way up to seven i measured 31 good luck all right at 32 um we're going back to that same pattern we had at three c e flat c e flat g c e flat c e flat g 36 g f g f and the last thing i do is go boo so here's 32 and it says frantically which is faster let's take it slow first and then we'll go back and do it faster and then the last thing is boo which i think you guys are good at saying that all right let's take it back to the beginning let's play it all the way through if you need to go back and um practice a couple things first do so now pause rewind replay here we are You've done that, you've practiced, here's the beginning. Start on C. One, two, three, four. spooky mansion so um work out some of those intervals i say there's a lot of c to e flat there's a lot of g to d's and g to e flats and g to c so practice some of those big jumps okay um secret word is lavender lavender see you later